Happy July 4th, my fellow strangers. It's Mrs. Strange back again. On today's third episode for Stranger Universe, I will talk about the Duffer Brothers saying that Stranger Things 5 won't be as long as Stranger Things 4. Before we start, please like, share, and subscribe to see more episodes from Stranger Universe. Please turn on your notifications to attend video premieres and get a chance to interact with Mrs. Strange and other Stranger fans. Help get this episode to 1000 views and likes if you really want to see us release more Stranger Universe episodes like this one. Please don't forget to share this video across all social media platforms to help fans and viewers join our Strange family and find this great Stranger Universe content. And now, let us begin. Now that Stranger Things Season 4 is completely released, the final chapter of the series is gearing up for pre-production. With Stranger Things 4, one of the first things to jump out at audiences was simply how long the season was. The nine episodes all had lengthy runtimes, with some episodes breaking the 90-minute mark, and the season finale clocking in at 2 hours and 20 minutes. But the Duffers have said this will not be the case for the fifth and final season of the series. In speaking with Collider's own Steve Weintraub, they revealed that while the season will still be longer than the earliest ones, their intention is to keep it closer to the 10-hour mark. When asked about it, Matt Duffer said, We thought season 4 was going to be 8 episodes, and they were going to be regular length. So if you had interviewed us before 4, that's what I would have said. I think we're aiming for 8 again. We don't want it to be 13 hours. We're aiming for more like 10 hours or something. I think it's going to be longer than season 1 because we just have so much to wrap up, but I don't think it's going to be as long as season 4. Ross Duffer said that an overall structural change to the story would account for the difference in runtime, adding, this season, for instance, it was two hours before our characters even realized the monster was killing people in Hawkins. You get to know them, you get to see them in their lives, what they're struggling with, adapting to high school, and so forth. Steve's trying to find a date, all of that. None of that obviously is going to be occurring in the first two episodes of season 5. They know what the threat is now, and so that will help speed it up. In addition to all of that, it seems like season 5 will entirely focus on the original cast of characters. Matt Duffer stated, We want to go back to a lot of the things we did in season 1. A lot of the original groupings and pairings that we had in season 1, there's something nice about coming full circle. This revelation gives even more hope for the fans wishing for more focus on characters like Jonathan and Will, the latter of which we went over earlier today in another video. Here's hoping that Stranger Things 5 comes out soon enough. Overall, very exciting times. And that is all that we have for today. Do you like the idea of Stranger Things 5 being shorter than Stranger Things 4? Today's special shoutout is for Murray Bauman. Comment down below to become our next special Stranger Universe shoutout. And don't forget to follow us at It's Triniverse on Twitter and Instagram to stay updated with us every day. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Stranger Universe. Please turn on notifications to never miss another Stranger Universe episode again. Help get this video to 1000 views and likes if you really want to see us release more Stranger Universe episodes like this one. Don't forget to share this video across all social media platforms to help fans and viewers join our Strange family and find this great Stranger Universe content. This episode was brought to you by Mrs. Strange, and this is Stranger Universe.